Man is dead tonight after being hit by a car on Townsend Road in Jacksonville, and the community is blaming a lack of sidewalks. First Coast News reporter Lana Harris has the story. Look at this. 0.2 miles. Oh, it's left as little bitty pieces. 0.2 miles is how long it takes to get from the Americana Park homes to the Speedway gas station on Townsend Road. But that was long enough for Billy Huber's friend Jimmy to get hit by a car. Look at all them little pieces. That's, it's a man's life. Just like Huber, Jimmy rode a scooter. He had a massive stroke a while back and didn't have very much use of his limbs. JSO says Jimmy was hit by a car while riding his scooter on the street around 1 a.m. But Huber says he had no choice. There's nothing but a steep ditch on either side. There's, there's no place to get out of the way. This is the start of Huber's neighborhood. And as you can see, no sidewalk. Huber says usually he and other scooter dependent motorists in the area pay for the lack of a sidewalk in harassment. There's no place to go except the Walgreens or the Speedway to get food or something to drink. It makes people mad because they come up behind me and I'm slowing them down and they blow the horn at me and throw things at me and cuss me out. This time, the cost was a man's life. Johnny Brazoit found out about Jimmy's death as he was going to visit him. Just killed one of my best friends. Can we do something about this? It's crazy. I miss him. This is the second person to die by car on this road in the past two months. Huber says something needs to be done. How many more people got to die before the city does something about it? It's ridiculous. That was Lana Harris reporting tonight. Now, we did reach out to the city of Jacksonville to ask if a sidewalk plan is underway for that area, especially with the new housing development under construction there. We are told that they are looking into it, but we're on your side and will continue to press for answers.